All right, welcome back. Ooh, that looks seems really loud. Um, all right, welcome back. Amazing timing. I was just seeing what was new on Twitch, and you went live. Oh, nice. <laughs> well, welcome in, Ali Robert. Welcome in, Papa Nixon. We're here for another um, let's watch of a um, uh, a new Netflix series called um, Triangle Strategy. So sit back, grab some popcorn, and let's uh, enjoy. Having the story told to us. I'm going to turn the mic down a little bit. It looks like it's getting kind of loud. Um, let me know how that sounds. <clears throat> um, cool. So here we go. Let's have a nice story told to us. Um, here we go. About Sarah Noah and his friends. And his new wife. Quixotic Anne is here. Turn it down even more. Yeah, I don't know why it went. It was so high. Um. Okay. How about this? How does how does that sound? Um. No, we're not very far at all. I mean, we're on we're level four <laughs> or chapter three. I think. I don't know. But um. Yeah. This game. I mean, we streamed it last Friday and. It was like five hours, and we did three battles because <laughs> there's a lot of dialogue. But um, but I love these kind of games. Um, for those of you that haven't seen Quixotic N, he's super cool, a fellow Shakespeare scholar. Nice full jump there. The grinders are not. It's still peaking. Hmm. Not get caught. Twelve seconds. Here is actually, I think, a little behind our previous time. I remember reading 13 on the market. Let's see if I can fix there. that. So, a couple of frames behind, but it happens when you don't turn to corners. Oh, you're gonna, you're gonna abandon us for Smash Bros. That's understandable. I understand. Um... FBI, open up! Oh God, the FBI is already here. Hmm, I'm not sure how, how, what else I can really do to. Well, let's just turn it down a little more, and then see if maybe we'll just uh, make it... That, that looks okay on the waveform. I don't know. All right. Let's see. What's happening with, with Sarah Noah? It's Wolfie, another person. Upon the lake shores of the source towers a giant likeness of the goddess, ever watching over the flourishing city and the palace below. This is the whole Up it. Okay. I know how to drop it. Ow. No! You shall not pass! <laughs> oh, that's a good. That's pretty funny. Um, you were doing good, but you were getting ha your ass handed to you by a byleth. I don't know if that's spelled correctly. Uh, it's it's I E T I. No, sorry, no E T H. Okay, we're on chapter three, part two. Okay, that's right. Okay, so last time we played this, we got all our friends together and we had to decide where we were gonna go. And I thought we should go to the land of the, the desert land, whatever they're called. And um, that's where we are. Just popping in. But hey, well, uh, it's always good to see you. I know my time on online is limited these days. It protected the holy state from both Glenbrook and Esbos. There we go. Oh god, Kirby's are here. Oh, and also my camera's broken. Good job. <laughs> Who used the... Did anyone even use the blue shell? I don't see it. Maybe I clicked on it by accident. <laughs> but there are the Kirby's. They're here. Okay. I just can't get over this art. Like, this is such a cool-looking game. I think penetrating these walls would be nigh impossible. 
A most courteous answer. I should have expected as much. All right, the city streets of Hizante, or Hizant. I think that's how you say it. <clears throat> What's that sound? Is it more bandits? offer their prayers up to the goddess's statue every day. They thank her for her blessing, for bestowing us with the source from which all Norzalia's salt is harvested. To see every citizen pray is astonishing. The goddess truly is at the center of all Hyzant, just as the stories say. Even so, are there none who'd use this time of worship to rob their fellow citizens? There are none so misguided among the goddesses' believers. All Hyzantians are guaranteed food, clothing, and shelter. Dude, they're the like communists. Has done everything in its power to eliminate poverty Do you use a compressor for mic audio? I'm not sure I know what that As means. Result, I have um, no this pop screen. For I think that's about it. Certainly if everyone were equal, I'm not an expert on these things. To fight about. But achieving absolute equality is impossible. <clears throat> the words of an unbeliever. The goddess showers her blessings fairly upon all who follow her teachings. <sighs> Before we visit the Hierophant, there is one thing I must tell you about Lady Frederica. Under normal circumstances, the head of our nation would not permit an audience with one of Roselle and Extract. What about, what about that? How does that sound? We have explained the circumstances, however, and she has been granted special permission to enter the palace as an envoy. I'm missing the story. That said, we would ask that Lady Frederica remain silent before the Holy One. Silent? Why? I reiterate that typically she would not be so much as allowed to attend. We ask for your understanding of our creed. Do you mean to treat one of Glenbrook's delegates okay. as if you weren't even there? Prince Roland, you are here in secret. It would not do for you to gainsay another nation's religious creed. I have no it's, objections. Yeah, I think I found it, yeah. Does this, what does this sound like? Apologies. You needn't apologize. Let us do what we came here for. We appreciate your understanding. Now then, let us show you to the palace. Let us show you to the palace. I feel like I had those settings all set up and they must have gotten removed or something. I think you said something, but I couldn't hear You can't hear it? Right now, you can't hear this? That weird. That is where the Hierophant resides. The Hierophant imparts us into the I'm super low now. Mystery. Okay, so how about this? Let's experiment. We're allowed to look upon the Holy One's face. None save Minister Edor, who conveys the divine words to us. Okay, what about... Okay, what about now? Pardon our intrusion, Lord Sereno. <laughs> Thank you for your gracious gesture. 
that's better okay all right well, let's go with that for now and then i'll i need to do my research and learn how all this stuff works and something i can figure out i wonder if it has anything to do with the salt iron war i watched somebody do a review of this game and he said the saltirian war like i thought saltirian was like a race or something i was like wow Okay, I'm, I wasn't totally paying attention. <laughs> All right, what are we doing? The mining venture. No, I'm, I'm for this, right? Yeah. I think that a valuable endeavor will fairly profit everyone. Fairly profit everyone, he says. It seems to peak when you're speaking closer to the mic. It's just weird because it's like I'm always told, like whenever I do any kind of recording for work, I always they always tell me like to get super, super, super close. So I don't know. I mean, I would rather be further back, like have it be like right here. So maybe because because I'm so animated, it would help to be able to stay a little further away. So maybe we'll try this. I don't know. Okay, I need to pay attention. This is important plot. So far, my favorite character is um, that chick that can move twice. Uh, Alex, I think, is that her name? Um, Anna, Anna, that's who, uh, I like her. Fascinating. Um, I heard the uh, the new Mario Kart tracks got released. I'd have to check those out tomorrow. Maybe we'll play some Mario Kart instead of Smash. I don't know. Smash has been like so consistent though. Maybe we should keep it going. People can just turn down their own audio if it's too loud, I guess. Well, it's also a matter of whether it sounds good, you know. Um, let me hear it. Oh, we have to decide where we're going. Okay, so that'll continue the plot, but there's also what's going on in Whiteholm Castle. We should probably check that out. So let's go there first. Look at that staircase. Like, can you imagine having like four really big steps? Oh, 
All right, that was it. Okay, um, let's go ahead. Wow, look at this city. <laughs> they have a big heart-shaped lake. The Ministry of Medicine. Oh, please let this be a battlefield. It's like made for it. <laughs> What, she could hear them? <laughs> New Final Fantasy drop today? What, what game is that? There's another one I have to add to the list? Final Fantasy Origin, Stranger of Paradise. Oh, so it's kind of a side, it's not a main entry. You seen those Kill Chaos memes? No, I don't know what that is. <laughs> Wonderful. You gotta watch the reveal trailer sometime. It's great. It's not great. Oh gosh. Maybe we'll look at it tonight. <laughs> not just a researcher. A reticent researcher. What's his problem? That's Sir Sarah no, Odie. No. <laughs> That'd be so fucked up. He's all mean to her. So, is this one of those walk around segments where I have to interrogate people? Alright, some merchants are open for business during the exploration phase and may be selling rare items you'll not find at the provisioner. Cool, yeah, let's talk to them. I haven't spent a lot of money, so I should have a lot of stuff to spend. Oh, you can like RP walk. Dude, whenever I play Final Fantasy XIV online, I feel like I'm the only person that walks anywhere. Everyone else is like running as fast as they can, but I like to just like RP walk everywhere. Oh shit. Uh, I always knew that the goddess and her followers looked upon the Roselle with disdain, yet I cannot help but worry for my people. It'll be all right. <laughs> yeah, I kind of am leaning towards that bottom one. Um, wow. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna go with that. I don't I don't love this kingdom. <laughs> they seem a little um URP walk all the time. Nice. I d whenever I play Skyrim I do it. I just it's so much more immersive, you know. I wish that most games what I what I wish they would do is make the walking a little bit faster and make the running like 
something that you shouldn't do all the time, you know? Especially in RPGs. I mean, because look how silly this is. Like, I'm just, like, running around town as fast as I possibly can. I guess it doesn't look that bad in this game, but some games it does. Everyone in Hazant knows the goddess's teachings. Obey the teachings and serve your nation. Yeah, I don't like this place. It's a little too, like... I don't know. It is not wealth that drives his aunt, but the faith and happiness of her people. Yeah, that's what you say, but what is it that brings such people happiness? I thought the answer was different for everyone. Ooh, that's a nice uh, Plato answer. My convictions have been strengthened. Oh, look, Jules is online. I learned about the Saintly Seven. I'm just guarding this, uh, you know, ledge to nowhere because we have a big problem with people walking off the ledge and falling to their deaths, so I'm just going to stand here. I said, why don't we just put up a fence? But, you know, it's terrible when NPCs walk faster. Yes, that's the worst. That's exactly what I mean, is when they, like, go... They, their walking animation's faster than your walking animation, but slower than your running animation. So you're just constantly, like, you know... I mean, I guess they do that so that you can't, like, ever get, like, like, they can't, like, you can't lose them, I guess, but it's just annoying. I like Roland. This guy's cool. He's Roland the Headless Thompson Gunner. Take care of that new wife of yours. What's up, peasant? Oh, that's Gila. Shit. I thought that was a fucking random peasant. She's, like, really valuable on the team. Now, my understanding is they can't die, so... I shouldn't worry about having to, like... You know, keep anybody alive. The soul, sorry, can't say I know much about it. It's a sacred place that a select few are allowed to enter. Why do I sound like this? I don't know. Must be nice having freedom to roam about another nation. Oh, jeez. Yeah, this is like kind of an oppressive country. I don't really like this. Oh, is this guy a merchant? He looks like a merchant. Welcome. How can I be of service today? What do you got? All right, a large HP recovery pellet, a firestone... Deals fire type magic damage to a single enemy and sets the ground ablaze. Interesting. Um, same thing, but freeze. And then, oh, same thing, but it spreads on water and then spreads fires. Interesting. Why would you want these, though? Renders the selected area flammable. Interesting. Let's get... Oh, we have a couple of these already. Um, gosh, I don't know if I really... Let's go ahead and get one to try it out. But I don't know. This doesn't seem like my... I don't know. We'll see. Okay. Hello. Okay. Doesn't seem like there's a lot of information being... Oh, here's Huette. She's cool, too. The, the bird girl. The, um, today we had a pep rally <laughs> at our fucking middle school. And was it for sports? Nope. It was for tests. Because we really want to do well on our state tests. Um, and uh, especially the writing test. Because if they do really well on the writing test, it looks really good on me. Because I was their writing teacher. And that's the whole reason they hired me, pretty much, is to boost those grades. So, it's kind of an important thing coming up. They, hopefully they do well. I just hope they try, because I taught them everything they need to know. Like, but I just know that some of them are going to be like, oh, I don't want to sit here and do this for four hours and just rush through it, you know? Is this a bathhouse? So do all the countries believe in the same 
like the same religion or is their goddess like not the same one that we support on top of the building well I think that was everybody did we talk to him okay we learned about Swordsley's responsibilities that's good I guess you gotta go pick up your sister all right well Papa Nixon um, thanks for stopping by man enjoy the rest of your night maybe we'll see you for smash tomorrow Oh yeah, I forgot you can move the camera. This is a cool looking game. They had incentives to do well on state tests. Yeah, they yeah, they should do that too. We do that for other stuff, like a lot of the um practice like a lot of the like practice stuff that they have to do like if you do so many of those you get like you know there's like a day where they go like bowling or whatever like they've done stuff like that i wasn't involved in it though well i think that's everybody <laughs> No, wait a minute. Where am I supposed to go? Oh. I forgot you can go in the buildings. <laughs> Look how they did the light coming in the window. That's cool. It also ended up being that principal's last year. So I guess we didn't do well enough. Oh, that's sad. Gosh, I hope the principal that I have doesn't leave. She's awesome. I feel like that makes or breaks it. Trying to get in that door. There we go. Jesus. Special executive, what's up? How you doing, man? Oh, see, I didn't have to buy an ice stone because I found one. In someone's house, and I just took it. <laughs> Okay, I don't think we've been in here. I don't think I, I guess I can't go in there. I think that's everything. I don't know what. Where am I supposed to go? <laughs> My mic is a little fuzzy. Ugh, that's what people people been saying. Man, this sucks. Um. I just don't know what to do to fix it. Yeah, you know, yeah, that's what broke the last one. Oh, 
Uh, yeah, I don't know. I just don't, I don't know. I just don't even know what settings to change. Um, yeah, we're just gonna deal with it. All right, where do I go? Maybe I do have to go back in here. Well, at least I got six hundred dollars. We talked to all these people. We can't go in there. And we can't go in there. Oh, you're supposed to just do that. Okay. Mr. Lila about what ails Lord Seymour? Okay, testing, testing. Let's see how this sounds. Lord Seymour commands great influence. We cannot let others know about his condition. I understand. Not even our allies can know of our weaknesses, lest they use them against us. Indeed. We cannot risk exposing ourselves to such danger for the universe's sake. Yeah, that does sound bad. I don't know what to do. Uh oh, something's happening. What if we just tried? Okay, now let's see how it sounds. Maybe that, maybe that did something. Okay, what about this? How does this sound? This sounds okay? Okay, what about this? How does this sound? No, it still sounds bad. But I'll deal with it for now. It's just scraggly. Yeah, I don't understand what's causing it. Because I don't know what any of this stuff does. Do I have two mics open? I shouldn't.
I don't know. I unplugged my headset to see if that helped at all, but... Oh, it's so annoying because it sounded so good. It sounded fine last week. Right, it's like I didn't even touch it. It's really frustrating. All right, well, whatever. Let's just continue. Um, what did I do before when it got really low? That was, I was adjusting the um, the compression thing that you were talking about. There's a compressor settings. There's ratio, threshold, attack, release, and gain. And I lowered the gain super low. But then it was like too quiet. I mean, I could do that again, but now what does it sound like? Is it super low again? It seems like it's picking up sound from all over the room. <laughs> Maybe that's what I need. I, I bet you, oh, you know what? Maybe that's what it is. It's plenty loud. It just sounds shitty, yeah. Okay, what about, it's still picking it up. Um, okay. Oh, I don't fucking know. It just drives me crazy when things don't work. But it's like people are gonna come in and hear the um what now it's super loud? No, it just drives me crazy when things don't work. What it's good now? Okay, so that worked then. What I tried all I did was people are gonna come in and hear the um what now it's super loud. It still doesn't sound perfect, but if it's, if that's better, then let's just continue, and I'll, I'll experiment more with it later. Um, but yeah, it was um, noise suppression, I guess. I don't know. Okay, well that's good. Let's just go with that for now. I don't want to hold up the stream any longer. But it's just like when people come in and it sounds like shit. I, I mean, I would leave too, you know. All right. So what's going on? They're being attacked. Heathens who reject the goddess's teaching. At their head is a researcher named Plinius, who escaped with some of our most valuable findings. You must retrieve these documents for us, Exham. Consider it done. But they could be anywhere in town by now. I will need all the eyes I can get on the lookout. I must remain here at the Ministry. Their spies may still be among us. Among us? Mr. Exham, we would be happy to be of service. We are in your debt, Lord Serenor. The men we pursue are researchers, proficient in the arcane arts. The insight of one burst in their ways would be invaluable to us. Take Corentin with you. He is one of my most talented researchers. Corentin? Oh, that guy? Corentin, you are to go with House Wolfwort and help them retrieve our research from Plinius. As you wish, Minister. He's like, as you wish. All right, my friend. I wonder if maybe those suppressing things were on there and they just got deleted for some reason. That's good to know. Okay. <clears throat> All right, yes, finally a battle. Okay, defeat Plinius. Wait, do they all share an inventory? 
I guess they do. I didn't think about that last time. Okay, um, what if Sarah Noah was down... Oh. Oh, we can put people over here. Okay, cool. Um, what if we... Well, let's keep them together. That's fine. We should probably have the healer over here, too. Oh, we can't. Okay, let's do this little squad, and then this little squad. Oh, I can deploy another unit? How do I do that? Oh, cool. Um... Wait. Oh, we need her, for sure. Yeah, I'm not big on this guy. I really like Anna, though. Okay, cool. Now let's commence the battle! The battle begins. Linnaeus, give yourself up. There is no escape for heathens like yourself. Even attempting to steal our nation's secrets is a grave crime. One I know you have not forgotten. This research is my life's work. I have poured my blood, sweat, and tears into it. What is so wrong with treating it as my own? Plinius, such an untainted passion for knowledge cannot hope to survive here. I had heard that Hyzant was a land without strife. It would seem that was too good to be true. We mustn't allow Plinius and his lackeys to get away. After them! Okay, let's get them. You can enter simulation mode by pressing the A button on a unit other than yourself. This allows you to test the consequences of various actions on the selected unit without actually performing them. Oh, okay. Interesting. Oh, you have to do it in order. That's right. I forgot there's actually like an like a initiative system in this. Um, okay. I kind of don't want her to. I guess she'll be okay. Make it down there? Not quite. Okay, so let's just kind of go here. I need to sort of draw them out. You leave me with no recourse. This battle is ours. You know, her. I kind of, I kind of want to keep her up on the high ground because she's like the archer. <laughs> There's haste. Defeat is not an option. Let us try out their weakness. I have your back. That certainly helps. we begin? Shall we begin? Okay, so I can't control him. Allow me. Blaine, heed my call. What? This power will protect us. Frederick can learn Flame Shield, cool. 
Okay, what's he gonna do? Scorch? Oh, come on, really? Oh, and he hit three of us with it. Oh, I do get to use Corentin. He's a mage, right? What does he do? Okay, he's got like ice spells, freezes the ground. Oh, wow. Those are strong. Kind of want to not deal with that right now. Um. Nice. Ooh, that hurt. Casting an ice attack on a freezable square will freeze it, though there are exceptions to this rule. Squares are frozen, reduce the mobility and accuracy of any units standing on them. Okay, cool. Frozen tiles can be melted by fire attacks. Okay. Casting an ice attack on a freezable square will. Yeah, yeah, we got that. Okay. More scorch. It's okay. We're going to wreck them next turn. Oh, there's a healer up there. We got to get that guy. Oh, no. Oh damn, he's strong. Oh, that guy heals too. Cool heads shall prevail. Most appreciated. Hey, she leveled up and learned for those in need. Let us try out. They're both resistant, but I'm still gonna do it. That guy's pretty awesome. Mm. Man, she's so low. Okay, she needs to move in here. Use a healing item. I'll take this. I feel stronger always. She leveled up. Didn't think you would get that for that, but okay. And then attack that guy. Good stuff. To survive. This battle is ours. Dark 
darkness engulfs you. Victory is ours. I will fight to my last breath. I like her too. Free and sniping from the rooftops. That's pretty cool. Ow. From where shall we strike? Okay, that's too high, so you can't actually attack. Alright, that'll finish that guy off. Oh, I forgot about the follow-up attacks, too. You gotta remember that. Nice. I shall try my level best. Your defense didn't that seem to work? I shall do what I can. Allow me. You have my thanks. Um, but thanks for uh, hanging out while they're was the mic issue i'm glad we got that fixed hopefully i can oh she's not she's not gonna be able to take that oh no she's still alive that's right because she healed i think this is gonna be an easy win i don't think we're gonna have anybody faint I will end this. for the good of all Man, that seems like so powerful to be able to just hit anyone that's in range like that. Regret ridiculing me. The price for such insolence is your life. Freeze! Damn, that hurt. And he ran away like a bitch. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and try to kind of cut him off at the pass, but also backstab this guy. Nice. Here I come. And then she's gonna fly over here. I think she's. Possibly close enough if she goes. Well, let's go here. Blinding arrow on maybe that guy. She could just use her regular arrow. You can finish that guy off. Let's do that. What have we here? Defeat is not an option. Damn, that guy's wrecked. You've left yourself open. I see a path to victory. I have your back. Thank you. Make her more powerful. I shall do what I can. And heal her up. Nice. I will end this. Oh, but she can't use fuck. Well, maybe we'll use one of these items. He's weak to fire. Work. 
either. Nice. And then do it again. Victory is within reach. I won't lose. Yeah, she's gonna need some help. You don't stand a chance. You leave me with no recourse. Cold wind blows. Nice. And where shall we strike? <laughs> this poke is Achilles' heel from below. He learned hawk dive. I wonder what that does. How annoying! I deliver you to the goddess. You've left yourself open. <laughs> Let's go ahead and grab that. Let us steal our defenses. Much appreciated. Cool heads shall prevail. I wonder if she's close enough to heal. Oh yeah, she is. Well, we're in pretty good shape. I think we got this. Much appreciated. So it falls to me. I doubt the silence is gonna work, but to further the arcane arts. You understand, don't you, Corentin? As a fellow researcher, I understand your plight. Even so, did everyone wear green yesterday? I didn't. Which was a mistake. <laughs> but luckily I had a backup plan. I cut out a I took some green construction paper and made a little four-leaf clover and attached it to my little uh you know, my little badge that I wear. And I just use that to get away from getting pinched because I don't want them assholes touching me. But most of the kids did because they knew that they would get it if they didn't. So here's the thing. This is my Fire Emblem brain kind of thinking, I like this character a lot, this Anna character, and I really want to use her. So I'm trying to get her XP. But she's so low. I guess we could... Whatever. Let's just let her... Stay safe. Although she's in the purple. Yeah, I guess she needs to run. Allow me. Okay, let's go ahead and keep let's just keep her right there actually. Because now we can use Scorch and hit him with it. With the powers in me. Wait, now he's weak to it? He was resistant to it a minute ago. Or or no, the ice spell he was resistant to, right? Yeah, yeah. Puddles will form. <laughs> Whoa, guys. This game's got puddles. Uh, when it rains, a fire attack is cast on snow or frozen squares, or an ice attack is cast on blazes. Got it. Oh, and then those can be electrified. Oh, this is some, like, Genshin Impact shit. I like this. Check this out. Oh, she doesn't attack from above? Oh, that's a shame. He's got to be low now. Oh, this will do it though, watch. Bamf and bamf. Oh, no, he's still alive. Well, I guess Sarah Noah gets the kill then. What's Hawk Dive do? Deal physical damage to a single enemy. Oh, but it has range. So I could theoretically go here and do Hawk Dive to get that extra bonus from being above. And plus, it looks cool. Nice. Goddess, I am not your pawn. I am merely. That was easy. That was an easy battle. Easy peasy. That Corentin guy seems really powerful. But so is um, Frederica. 
The only one that had a little bit of trouble was Anna, but that's because she kind of just got jumped, you know? It's so satisfying when you um, beat a mission on these kind of games. Was that guy's name Pinius? I think it was Plinius with an L. But it's basically penis, yeah, basically. <laughs> I, I just want somebody to make an RPG where the protagonist is like a knight or something. Like he looks all noble and shit, but then he's like, Plinius, more like penis. You, <laughs> you know, he just talks like that the whole game. Sell them for riches? No, we wished only for freedom in our research. It's like Polonius, but no, spelled stupid. No such liberty here. We were left with no choice. I see. I see. Fell against her teachings, as I suspected. Take them away. Oh, you know, now that I mention it, I can I can see on those the waveform that it's not picking up all the extra sound. Yeah, that really did fix it. You have our gratitude. You have our gratitude. Not have apprehended the heretics without you. Yeah, heretics. I don't like heretics. To them now? I have the perfect email for that comment too, by the way. Defying the goddess's teachings is the most grave crime one can commit in Hyzant. I see now. Equality here stems from their thorough elimination of heretics. You did well, Corentin. For your efforts, you deserve a reward. <laughs> uh, I was the tactician of that battle, by the way. Uh... If you insist, I do have a request. <laughs> I would like permission to embark on a journey. I wish to learn more about the medicines of other lands. Greater knowledge of medicine would prove useful in our studies of life. I will consider it. <laughs> she said we'll think about it. <laughs> Master Corentin, thank you for your help today. Not a fan of pennies, all they do is take up space. Some countries don't have a like smallest denomination. This place is too conspicuous. Let us talk elsewhere. You wish to leave Hyzant? Yes. I wish to study magic, not medicine. But just before, you spoke of wanting to observe medical treatment in other nations. He was lying. Seriously, Frederica? To gain permission to leave. We cannot research freely in high He's a pretty badass mage, though, so we probably want him to do that. In fact, he should come with us. Furthermore. No matter how revolutionary our discoveries may be, the world at large will never know them. You mean to say you tire of Hyzant's secrecy? You're not much different than those so-called heretics, then. Could it be you feel some connection with them? I will say, I don't love that, like, why would they not let you use all of your characters? Like, why did he, Eridor have to sit that fight out? Like, if it's a matter of balance, they could have just added more enemies. I don't know why they had to make it... Like, you just can't use him, you know? Like, eventually I understand because there's going to be too many characters, but like, right, seriously, like, this is like the fourth fight. To tell the truth, I was well aware of Plinius' plan. But I was a coward. One who could neither stop nor join them. And because of it... I ended up capturing those with whom I sympathized. I wish never to feel this way again. And thus you mean to leave the holy state entirely? Yes. I have no intention of returning to the ministry. Which is why I must ask if you would allow me to journey with you. Nice. As a member of House Wolfort. Fuck yeah, we want you on our team. You're a badass. 
You can kill everybody on the whole enemy team. While he may be a unique character, he undoubtedly possesses a great understanding of the arcane. <laughs> he seems cool to me. Let him join. There is one thing I must know. Would you be troubled traveling alongside my betrothed, knowing her heritage? Oh, does he have a pro oh, they have a problem with them. That's right. I'm abandoning Hyzant and the goddess's teachings with it. Good. Good for you, dude. <coughs> On the contrary, Lady Frederica's magic fascinates me. <coughs> I would love to learn more about it. But of course. <laughs> it's well, just then. like yours, Welcome except a different element, right. but okay. See your studies to your heart's content. I only ask that you put them to use on House Fulcourt's behalf. Of course. You have my thanks, Lord Serenoa. Lord Serenoa. 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 Oh, Serenoa. Alright, freezes. Yeah, we know this. Oh, he's gonna get an ice wall ability, isn't he? Every ice character has to build ice walls for some reason. <laughs> Alright, cool. Well, uh, let's see. Is there another side mission, or are we uh, just gonna. I guess we're just moving on. My guess is that different. Th oh, no, there is something up here uh, in, in Ironstone. Or no, it's called. This is an Ace Frost. Okay, cool. Does Dragan fair? Okay, there's no way these guys aren't evil. Look at them. As blustery and boastful as ever, brother. He is simply beside himself that his contributions to the mine have been recognized. So he has achieved a measure of success. Um, okay, well, hold on. This guy's name is Gustadolf. Gustadolf. Well, I guess they just didn't want to call him Adolf. So he's Gust Adolf. What concern is he of ours? He is Sparag's son, and or maybe he's just life. Adolf. We are not Glenbrook or Hyzant, Thalus. In Esfrost, a man is judged for his deeds, not his pedigree. And yet you have appointed me prime minister, have you not? I have given you an opportunity, brother. Do not be mistaken. If you wish to keep your position. Prove to me you are deserving of it. Oh, jeez. Understood, brother mine. Dear brother, do with Thallus as you please, but I bid you be wary of Dragan and Svarog. Who's I Svarog? I know Dragan. On higher seats. If they mean to overthrow me, then let them try. Oh, shit. <laughs> let them try. I the opportunity to crush them. Okay. My question is, why would you, like, I don't know, maybe later on clicking on these will cause, maybe there will be parts that you interact with, but it's like, um, why are they making me go all the way over here just to watch a cutscene and then go over here to watch another one? I don't know. It's weird. But maybe later on there's actual interactivity. Uh, Dragging these nuts, everybody. <laughs> Time we head home. You aren't forgetting anything, are you, my lord? My lord? Arador, I told you, I'm not a child anymore. I'm sorry, my lord. Whenever I see your face, I can't help but think of the lad I once knew. <laughs> Can you not lower your voice? You'll disturb the whole city at this rate. All 14 people that live here. House Wolfort certainly is lively. I don't know, everybody sounds like they're talking in a booth. Indeed. I've never seen such a big, happy family. I'm glad they allowed you to travel with us. As am I. I intend to revolutionize the world with my research. You do that, bruh. 
Honestly, so far he seems the most interesting character. Him and Roland are my favorite so far. Story-wise. Playstyle-wise, I like Anna. Yes. Let us make it a grand wedding. Duet? Oh, and Huet. I like her too. She's cool. She's gonna be the old staple, you know it. Like Huet's gonna be that underdog, not underdog, but like unappreciated MVP, you know? Seems I'm just in time. Uh-oh. I came to thank you and see you off on behalf of the Holy One. Well, thank you. We are the ones who should thank you. Um, I won another um, shall not forget your kindness. um, my Nintendo prize, which are, is a keychain of the box art for Mario 64 and uh, Ocarina of Time. It's just a little keychain, and I thought that was cool. And actually, my tracer keychain broke, so I need a new one. I'm happy to have seen Hyzant with my own eyes. Till we meet again. This place sucks. It's too hot, and I don't like it. Lord Serenor. The future of Norzelia is in the hands of the young, those like ourselves. I much look forward to our next meeting. The heartbeat thing is weird. I, I don't, that creeps me out. We have heard much about how all in High Zant are blessed by the goddess's teachings. And yet. They told us almost nothing of the Roselle. Hmm. What sort of lives do they live here? What sort of life did Mother lead? Is something the matter, Frederica? Forgive me. I was merely lost in thought. Lost in thought all alone. Thoughts of the Roselle, I presume. Thoughts of the Roselle. She's like, don't read my mind. Yes. I wondered what effect it might have on your relations with Hyzant, now that we are to wed. Right now, our three nations work together, but none can say what the future holds. I still think it's a bold choice that they put a, an arranged marriage in the very beginning of the game. I don't know. Not have to bear it alone. It will be a burden for all of House Wolfort to bear, together. And they're not even like awkward about it. They're just sort of like on board. I mean, he lucked out, let's be honest, but still, you know. A land of sand and sun. Complete. Cool. Well, let's keep going, I guess. We just passed the one hour mark here on the stream, saving the game. And we are now on chapter three, part two, level five. On the Switch's top visual novel. Octo triangle path strat. All right, here we go. Diplomatic visit as Lord of the House complete. Serenoa returns to the Wolfort domain. Safely within Glenbrook, Roland and Huet retire to Whiteholm in the Crown City. Alas, there is no time for rest in House Wolfort. As Serenoa soon finds himself swept up in preparations for his wedding to Frederica. Oh, my wedding's coming, dude, and you know what that means. Um, when, when did Hilo say the game opens up? I don't remember. Uh, it's got to be soon. I'm, I'm guessing the wedding is going to be a, a turning point, if I had to guess. Oh. Okay. Chapter 4. That was the end of Chapter 3, Part 2? And now we're down here in the- OH SHIT! Look at that explosion! What is that? Oh. Well, that's Dragon, right? That should yeah. be the end of that bodice of bedrock. Investigate it at once! I like him. I don't know why, I just like him. What in the name of iron? What is it? Do we require more explosives? No, Lord Dragan. You best come see for yourself. <laughs> Just the 
little sprites are just they're so adorable but the story's like all serious and like oh, really God. grounded it couldn't be what is it is it a crystal skull is it a lightsaber that settles the wedding program then we still must decide upon the wedding dress however uh -oh. <laughs> they didn't think about that Surely the lady herself must decide. Yeah, seriously. What do you desire, Frederica? I... Well... Hadn't you mentioned wanting to dress in the Roselle custom for the ceremony? Yes, I approve of that. best to ask the Roselle about that. There's a Roselle village here in the Domain. I'm sure they'd make you a dress if you asked. But what of the other nations in attendance? Surely Hyzant would not look kindly upon it. Fuck them! <laughs> Is it true that you assisted the Rizal who fled Hyzant during the war, and that you then granted them asylum here? Aye, that is how the Rizal came to live within our domain. It was a source of great tension, but in the end, Lord Simon's perseverance prevailed. And a group of <laughs> These actors are trying so hard not to say Simon. Every time they say his name, they're like, Simon! They be returned to Hyzant citing their goddess's teachings as justification. Mm. The roots of the conflict run deep. Nevertheless, and that's why religion's bullshit, everyone. To take under our wing. <laughs> Should you choose to dress in the Rosellan custom, we shall Do we get to choose? That'd be cool if we actually did get to choose. I I'm, I'm going to say yeah, let her do it. Is that so? Then I see not how I could refuse such a kindness. I shall accompany you to the village. <laughs> but you're not allowed to see her in the wedding dress yet, Saranoa. It would be a good opportunity to get to know them, to strengthen our bonds. As is he has such a weird voice. <clears throat> For Zell and custom it is, then. Let us depart at once. God damn it. I dropped my controller. Hi, all Fuck! Ooh, I can't wait to see what they come up with. You haven't been paying attention to the story? Did the Salt Iron War start yet? No, that, that already happened. That was in the past. Now, basically, the Salt Iron War was like a feud between these three countries, but we're trying to come together on this big mining project to like bring the three countries together because currently this country, Hyzant, has access to all the salt. Or, well, but they trade. I think they, th my understanding is that they trade with each other, but like, they still kind of have a monopoly on it. And then like, and then the same thing is true for the Northern region, they have all the iron. And then we're trying to create this like central mine operation right here. I guess, I don't know. That looks like Splash Mountain. I can't, every time I look at it, I see Splash Mountain. I'm just making sure there's not. <laughs> this is such a dumb way to look for scenes, but my, my understanding is you can miss them. So I wanna make sure I don't miss anything. Okay. Um, but my guess is there's gonna be another war. <laughs> Things are going to go south. They're going to be mad that she's wearing her traditional dress. It's like, oh, how dare you? And they're going to be pissed. Greetings and welcome, Lord Saranoa and Lady Frederica. And actually, I got to say, I'm kind of interested in what's going to happen because so far, I don't really like these Hyzantians very much. I like the East Frost people, but you can also tell that they're doing something sketchy too. They're a little evil looking, you know, they're a little Star Warsy. Oh my god, they all have pink hair. Oh, they all have pink hair. I want to live here. Of the Roselle. And congratulations on your engagement, as well as assuming lordship of your house. You have my gratitude. We hope you will continue to lend your support to House Woolfort. So, when Serenoa and Frederica have kids, are they gonna, um... Are they gonna... It, the baby's gonna be half Rosalian, so is it gonna be like a dark red color or, or, or what, you know? Or, or are they still gonna keep their pink hair? Whatever the war will be called, it won't sound as cool as the salt iron. That's what I was saying. I think they should have called this game salt and iron. 
I think that would have been a cool name. I don't know why they had to keep this <laughs> triangle bullshit. I think they could have just called it Salt and Iron, and I think that would have been dope. But you know, what the fuck do I know? I'm just a, I'm just a fucking gamer. All right. I owe your Lord Father a great debt. Though even were that not the case, you are engaged to one of our own and Lady Frederica. Few things could bring us more joy. We shall make the finest dress you have ever seen. Hell yeah. He makes her like a bikini. Subject, <laughs> I have one humble request. I would like to incorporate this pendant into the design. Ooh. The pendant you were never without. Tis one of a kind. Left to me by my late mother. She was one of the Rosellen refugees who I just love this kind of shit. I don't know. I, I just eat this up. Like I want to live in a world like this. In a twist of fate, she fell in love with the former Archduke, and thus was I born. In secret, of course. After I was born, she was sent back to Highzand. Where she met her end. I see why it never leaves you. Pray fashion the dress in this pendant image. It shall be done. Let us delay no further. Lady Frederica, please step inside that we may take your measurements. Thank you kindly. <laughs> and in true JRP fashion, the, the bikini will be really good armor. <laughs> to be fair, looking at the art of the characters, they're, they're pretty good about female armor. You know, I mean, I know that's a controversial subject, but like, it does bug me when like they, the men wear realistic armor and then the women are in bikinis. It's It's stupid, you know? Perhaps I'll have a look around the village. While they're taking her measurements, I'm sure that won't take that long, but... I learned how to take measurements in college because I took a costume class. And the final exam was to create a full costume from head to toe with accessories. We got to work in partners and me and my partner, we did Willy Wonka. We had, you had to like pick a famous character and we did Willy Wonka and our model was an Asian girl so we created this like Asian female Willy Wonka and it was awesome <laughs> it is stupid but it is nice to look at well that's my thing I mean like people shit on Pyra for having that skimpy outfit but I'm like whatever she looks fucking awesome you know who cares um it depends on the setting this game's kind of like realistic kind of feeling so i feel like they should go with more realistic armor but nothing's realistic in xenoblade so it makes sense that she would just look cool you know <clears throat> um hello old oh it's the elder i was right so i don't know for me it just depends on the on the scenario like you look at bayonetta and it's all like sexualized and stuff and who cares it's fucking awesome you know she's like a dominatrix but yeah it depends on the setting definitely <clears throat> oh shit, what did she say? Your th we came to this land in the midst of the Salt Iron War, desperate to escape his aunt's extraordinary cruelty. Your father then granted us asylum in our hour of need, shielding us from further harm. I would have done the same. <laughs> I would have done that. D I yeah. I pray the day soon comes when you no longer need re require protection and are free to live the life. This is freaking, what is he, giving a speech? And I intend to honor that. Let us work together and make this land a prosperous one. Prosper, pr prosperous one for your people. Good enough, let's go with that. I cannot th <laughs> I cannot thank you enough for those kind words. May they be a beacon of hope for the generations to come. She just became Irish, just because. We will do all in our power to make it so. Father granted the Roselle asylum to our lands. Though they once hailed from Hazent, they are now as much a part of the Wolfert domain as anyone else. I learned about the Roselle, yeah, yeah, okay. Oh, go up, go upstairs. Your hair certainly does make you stand out. Because <laughs> I don't have pink hair. <laughs> That's funny. Hello. Dude, imagine a Mario RPG remake in this style. 
That would be so cool! I wanna see Gino like in- what the? Oh, okay. I can go up ladders now. Can I walk across tight ropes? No, I can't. But I can go up here. What was the point of that? Just to... I guess just to show you that you can do that? <laughs> Hello, Pikmin. You gotta go to refill your drink, get a snack, and go to the bathroom in that order. That is the correct order to do that in. Um, yeah, get some popcorn, because this is basically a movie. Of course, nothing will beat the fucking Metal Gear Solid. Is it four or five? I think it's four? Metal Gear Solid 4 has, like, a cutscene that's, like, an hour and a half long. Like, I'm not even joking. Hello, little child. It's still fun staying in the village all the time. I want to go play somewhere else. But mother gets mad at me if I go too far. That's because you're a dumbass. No, it's because you're precious to her. No. Ah, but there's plenty of fun to be had here. Look at the three buildings and the four trees. You'll be able to venture further afield when you're older. That's the correct answer. Um, and when that day comes, I'll show you both around the domain myself. <laughs> oh, you're a single mother, you say? I would be glad to show you around. I can't wait to grow up. Trust me, you, you, you can wait. Hello, Pink Knight. We must stand strong and vigilant if we are to maintain the peace we have enjoyed on these lands. I like the Rosellen. I'm so glad I'm marrying into their clan. Okay, well, I guess that's everybody. <laughs> Can I go in any of these buildings? <laughs> They're all like... Yeah, what the fuck? There's no doors. <laughs> oh, wait, here we go. There is one down here. Oh, but this might be the, the tailor. Yeah, this is where... Oh, no, this is like... Dude, it's Robin! Oh, it's Anna. <laughs> she looks like Robin! I thought she had blonde hair. I guess she has white hair. Dude, she seriously looks like Robin. It might seem like I'm just skipping through this, but I actually read really, really fast. I can read these, the dialogue in that amount of time. I basically became a speed reader when my job was to read plays all day long for a whole year and I would read essentially like three or four plays every day. Uh, okay, um... So I guess it was just to get information? <gasps> There's a cat! Oh my god, look at the kitty! <sighs> So cute. Hold on. We got to go to the kitty. Hello, kitty. Meow. Meow. So cute. Oh, there's something right here. Cool. All right. Well, I guess that's everything. She ready to go? Oh, woman, are you done getting measured already? Meanwhile. Who's that? Do you understand oh, right now. how dangerous it is for a young prince to go gallivanting off on a whim? That's what princes do, they gallivant. But if I hadn't gone gallivanting, I never would have learned the state of things outside our own kingdom. Oh. Oh? Well, if you are so interested in international affairs, then I have a fitting role for you to play. You will oversee the Grand Norzellian Mines. Father, it would be a privilege. 
I fear that punishment would provoke no reflection. And so I would rather put your energies to work for the kingdom. I shan't let you down, father. I am not blind to your feelings, my son. I understand that my methods vex you. Ooh, good use of the word vex. You don't get to see that a lot. Out of harm's way and give me no reason to worry. Of course. Mining is grueling, thankless work. Show the miners the appreciation they deserve. But don't show them too much appreciation. They are miners, after all. I shall. You have my word. The necessary provisions have been arranged, Your Highness. You are the FBI, open up! Father, may I bring Sarah... Rather, Lord Woolforth. It is his job to oversee the operation, after all. And his closeness with Brigand may engender goodwill. The heartbeat. What the fuck is with that? The dum, the dum, the dum. Who now binds him to Estrost? You would do well to be wary of any move he or his house might make. So you share Franny's views on the matter. <laughs> Nevertheless, Sarah Noah is a friend I could never hope to replace. A friend I trust, no matter your opinion of him. Try, right, homie. Concerning words, your highness, House Wolford must be subject to the same scrutiny as any other. Oh my god, what was that delivery? That fucking line, your highness, Wolford must be subject to the same scrutiny as any other. Roland. Roland. The king was good, Regna was good. Bring these tidings to Gustadolf at once. Um, that's a bird. I guess you can talk to the birds. Says everyone? Good. I have important news for all of you. What you see before you is to be seized by the Duchy of Esfrost. You shall not speak of this beyond those in present company. Any what is it? Will be punished to the fullest extent of the law. But Lord Dragan. Are not the resources we mine destined to be shared among nations? Oh, they f oh. This matter is not up for debate. They found something really valuable, and they're not going to share it, which is the whole point of this operation. And so I ask this of you: <laughs> stand with me as I lead this great realm into a new era. Greed. I'm telling you, man. The fucking heartbeat! What is the deal with the- giving us these orders. <laughs> <coughs> I shall do exactly as you say. I thank you. I have already sent the Archduke a letter informing him of our find. When I am appointed Prime Minister, I promise to reward you all handsomely for delivering me such a boon. You are to be I wonder what it is. If it's a crystal, I'm gonna be a little disappointed. I'm kind of done with crystals in these games, but you know. With this, I shall make my mark and do what neither father nor Gustadolf ever could. What news from Jurgan, dear brother? I love that this guy's throne room is. Decorated like a Benihana. I never dreamt our hypothesis would prove true. So you take him at his word? I have no choice. The spy I sent to shadow him corroborates his report. And? What are his demands? He wishes to be named Prime Minister in exchange for secreting it away to Esfrost. Negotiations with Glenbrook are in the offing, should I refuse. So he means to threaten you. He is stronger than I believed him to be. Certainly what he has uncovered is worth the price he asks. What would you do, were you me? Keep the secret safe, naturally. Did you not send a spy for this very reason? Surely expected this would happen. I did, and they have been issued emergency orders. Then leave the rest to me. 
I shall depart at once. I'm just like really into the story. Um, m M&M cookies better or worse than chocolate chip? Ooh, I would say better. You mean cookies with M&Ms in them? Yeah, that's, I would say better. Not that I can eat that kind of stuff. I'm trying to, trying to eat healthy. <laughs> Dragon, you will rue the day you dared place Glenbrook beside me. Oh, okay, Glenbrook sounds like a, um, like rent-adjusted apartment. I hand down the orders. I hand down the orders. Yield, or be crushed beneath my heel. That's a badass line. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I love the little wood pieces like coming in like cars. Uh, it's amazing. This story is actually really getting good. You missed a lot actually, Alleyway. Um, basically in the mines, there was um, Dragon, Dragon, Dragon and his crew found something and we don't know what, but he found something really important and decided to keep it and bring it to the Ace Frost Kingdom um, without telling anybody, even though the whole point is that we're supposed to share the materials. So something bad's happening okay is that everything is there not another mission anywhere okay you think you prefer plain chocolate chip a little more well the always good to hear when someone tries to eat a little healthier well yeah no i'm i'm on a pretty like strict diet i'm trying to really get in shape <laughs> the dress measurements are finished at last I applaud your patience. Is it exactly as you hoped? <gasps> is she is wearing it or is that what she always wears? Wait to see it oh, it's not done. Okay. I am glad to hear it. I don't his voice is cute. It, I don't know. It's not that bad. Prince Roland and Huet besides. What brings you here? He does have a weird like It's like he has a different accent than everybody else. Heard you all had come here. something happened yeah there's something about his like consonants that are like different than everybody else i don't know father has asked me to keep watch over the mines won't you join me you scarcely need ask of course a wise course of action seeing as you will be overseeing the mining operations and we can present Dragam with the gifts we procured abroad a fine opportunity to get to know the man better. He is quite talented, is he not? He is a man with grand visions for the future. That much is certain. Yeah, that much is certain. Then let us waste not one moment more. To the mines. I'll have the dress ready in time for the ceremony, my lord. You have my thanks, Jerome. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, I think everything's gonna go down at the wedding. I think the wedding is going to be the turning point, <laughs> which, if you think about it, is smart because Sarah Noah and Frederica journey to the Rosellen village so she may be fitted for her wedding gown. The young Lord gains an unexpected moment of quietude while he waits. Because they've been building up this wedding for a while, so it makes sense that that would be like the the um, inciting incident will happen there, you know. However. Roland soon arrives with orders from King Regna to inspect the Grand Norzellian Mines, where Dragan has made great progress. <laughs> Fucking Captain Falcon in his F-Zero cart. What's it called? The Blue Falcon? <laughs> That's what it looked like. Uh, are we just moving on? No other scenes to watch? Okay. How will Gustadolf respond to my offer? I should think there's but one logical answer. And should he refuse for some reason, I will need father's aid. I must apprise him of the situation. Hmm. So yeah, anyway, yeah, he has some kind of valuable thing. We don't know what it is yet, but he has something important. And he found it here in the mines. Lord Dragan, Prince Roland. 
or his men found it while mining. So it probably is some kind of crystal. What's up? Prince Roland and my friends of House Wolfort. To what do I owe the honor? Apologies for the sudden nature of our visit, Dragan. I have come on father's orders to offer our sincere gratitude, as well as to observe the mining operation. The Balrog. <laughs> Splendid. The miners will no doubt be heartened by your highness's presence. The Arkenstone. Does the mining continue? You know it's going to be some dumb crystal. Indeed it does. We'll there see. Are no problems to report. And what of your trip abroad, Lord Serenoa? It was most enlightening indeed. We even brought something for you. I do hope it's to your liking. A portrait of the goddess herself, drawn with... Is this dyed salt? It is. I understand they are used as talismans in High Zen. <laughs> this gift would fetch unfathomable value in the duchy. I... I cannot thank you enough. <coughs> it is enough to see you happy. <laughs> I am glad our deliberations were not in vain. Dragan, I believe it was you who said the future is in the hands of the ardent youth. So I wonder what would have happened if we went to the other city. I mean, I guess that's the whole point, is it's a branching path story, but like, it must, I wonder, yeah, I'm gonna have to play this game again. We are of like mind. Let us shape the future together. The fucking heartbeat. I Indeed. That future is close at hand. I suspect we all heard you. The border and ask for your cooperation in due course. And I shall gladly assent. Yes, we eagerly await your offer. Now then, I was thinking I might examine the quarry. Wait, your highness. One of the tunnels caved in but a few days ago. Oh, he's lying. Eyes against entering just now. Did you not assure us moments ago that the mining continues apace? Yeah, exactly. The miners are working to repair the damage as we speak. It is simply too soon to allow you inside. Oh, he's up to no was good, dude. It was, in fact. We were perhaps a bit overzealous in attempting to remove some of the bedrock. I had no idea your explosives were so powerful. How do you make them, anyway? I would love to tell you, your highness, but... I'm afraid we must keep some of our secrets. <laughs> I love this guy. He, he's a dick, but I love him. Surely you jest. I thought you'd be surprised. I could scarcely believe it myself at first. A gargantuan tome in the archives opened my eyes to the many uses for salt, beyond seasoning our daily dishes. And now I pass what I've learned to you, Lord Serenoa. As a token of my gratitude for your visit. Ooh. The power of salt. The power of salt. Serenoa kind of sounds like someone from Europe speaking with an American accent. Well, I don't know. He, he just sounds like he has. Fascinating indeed. I don't know. Would like to read it when you are through, my lord. It's weird because like the only other voice I've heard him do is Silvando, which was nothing like this. Shall we save a tour of the mine for tomorrow? Yes, perhaps that would be best. I don't think he's English. entertainment and lodgings for your party at Or European. Uh Taylor Clark Hill. Or no, this isn't, no, that's not the right person. He plays Prince Franny. No, it was somebody else. Um, Yeah, Shy Matheson. Okay, yeah, that's his name. Okay. Uh, Shy Matheson. Let's see. He was, um...
Yeah, it doesn't say like where he's from. It's hard to get a lot of information. Hmm. Well, let's go to his official website. How about that? <laughs> oh, he is. Oh, he is based in London. You're right. He's English. Yeah, he's based in London. So, well, there you go. <laughs> his website needs. His website's pretty nice. Look at his headshot. I love how he has his headshot, even though he's primarily a voice actor. Well, he's done. It looks like he's done theater too. Oh, he did Henry IV. <laughs> I love looking at actors' websites. All right. Anyway, sorry. Uh, let's get, let's continue. Added the power of salt. I play League of Legends. I have the power of salt. <laughs> But no, you're right. He is uh, he is English and doing an American accent. But he's not really doing an American accent. Is the thing he's like doing like he's like trying to meet like everyone else is an American doing a fantasy accent, and he's like trying to like meet them. Maybe I don't know. It's weird. I can tell already this looks like an amazing map for a fight. He's just trying to not sound like he's from London. The thing is that like, you can tell like, he obviously knows what he's doing. I just, I think it's more about the direction than anything else. Like, I think they didn't give him any character or any, and, and like, to be fair, this guy, like he's not written exactly the most, he's like, what is this character? Like if you had to describe him in 10 words, he's okay. He's taking over the throne i mean what is he ambitious is he kind i don't know i guess he has to play it kind of neutral too because you're sort of playing him i don't know i don't i don't hate it i don't hate it at all like i think he's i think he's good it's just it's just weird i don't know like a lot of people are really giving him shit it's it's not bad at all <laughs> Let me just talk to you from down here. <laughs> can, I, can I get back up there? I guess I'll go this way. Okay. Dude, Anna's such a badass. Hello. Oh, you at? Why does she look different too? Like, I don't remember her having purple hair. Purple hair, purple hair. Yeah, this is where they found whatever it is that they found. The magical crystal of crystal light and damage and life. All right, let's go talk to Gary Oldman. Oh, found something. How do I fucking, there we go. Oh. Nice. Oh, the mining schedule. That sounds important. Got some stone. Hmm. How would you respond? Okay. Um, I would resolve the matter peaceably, peaceably with the other 
countries. I would hear of the problems firsthand from the miners themselves. Issuing orders blindly from above leads to chaos. I would never. I would order an investigation into the cause and find the party or party. Yeah, no, not that. Um. I would probably just. I think he would say he's going to deal with it firsthand. But I also think he's kind of naive. I guess the first option was what he was looking for. All right, well, did we, f I mean, do we just continue? All right. Everything appears to be in order, except for that uh, mysteriously um, closed off section of the mine. All right, everything looks good. I usually don't like internet culture wiggling its way into games, but for some reason, I really want someone to say these nuts. I know. Yeah, I know. <laughs> That's what I was saying. Like, it'd be funny if there was a, a character that just did that, you know? Um, okay. Ooh, there's a fight happening. Anything else that we need to check into? Are we actually going to play a game? Are we going to play the game? Play the game of love. All right, let's do it. <clears throat> no word from below you say they haven't tried to flee have they the thing is i will say i think it's pronounced dragon so it wouldn't i mean dragon these nuts doesn't work as well but oh come on why is it not on auto no sir i've not seen a single soul emerge from the mine very well then i shall make contact with them myself What's that? What's that? It came from within. What is the meaning of this? Dude, it's Shovel Knight. Oh, shit. Why are they at the mines? No. Did he see through my plot? Clear the mine. Leave no survivors. Oh, shit. Those dogs. Okay, so apparently Dragon is not as high up in the Ace Frosty kingdom as I thought, because they're like totally screwing him over right now. Oh yeah. Okay, we can't let Dragon fall. We have to protect him. Oh. You know what? Let's give it to him. Hell yeah. Um, okay. And then unit placement. Okay, so we got Corentin, who's a badass. Oh, this is such an amazing layout for a map, too. Okay, so I'm, I'm going to want to put my, my cavalry down here, for sure. Okay. Um... Also, have we placed everyone? Okay, we get to use everybody this time. That's cool. Understood. Yeah, we get to use everybody this time. That's that's awesome. And you have to use uh, Sarah Noah. Oh, just look at the art, dude. These characters look so cool. Decimate the enemy forces. That means you only have to kill 10%, right? No, I think you have to kill them all. Oh, that's what. Oh, look at his art. We haven't seen this yet. He looks cool. He's a little more gaunt than I thought he was. I thought he was a little more like, you know, strong jawed. Um, but yeah, he's cool looking. I love her. She looks like Encanto. <laughs> he's a little behind in level because I didn't use him last time. So let's let's make sure he gets some experience this time. Okay, um, Bird Girl is gonna be a little bit of a problem. Oh no no, Bird Girl is gonna be amazing on this map because she can fly around. 
But I do think they need some help over there. So let's put... Let's... Hmm... You know what? I don't even let's, I don't even think we need to deal with that. Let's just put let's take Anna and put her over here, and the bird can go here, but she's gonna immediately fly up here. Okay, I think that's good. Her name's Hewitt. Hewitt, not Bird Girl, but I'm gonna call her Bird Girl. I am bird girl. Protect Lord Dragan. Protect Lord Dragan. Where is he? All right. If you end your turn without moving or using a command, the time until your next turn will be reduced by the following amounts: no movement, ten percent; no commands used, ten percent; both twenty. Cool. That's actually good to know. So you can, so you can actually sort of stall. And then get to go again faster. Oh, that's Dragan. We have to protect him. Um, okay, that's Anna. I'm gonna move her here. She's always she always goes first. I guess she's a thief, that's why. My turn. My turn. Okay, you can you're pretty tough. I think you can actually go here. Stay on the high ground though. Curses. What's going on? <laughs> Hits him with the book. And then runs. Here I come. Oh, I never thought about that though. Like hit and run. You can kind of do that in this game. Okay, she's gonna fly. Oh, she can't actually. Okay, we'll go. Fuck. Go here. I thought she could get up here. Damn. All right, well, just go here for now. Right there. <laughs> I will say this is not looking good for our um, United Nations project that's happening here. Um, this is supposed to be a joint venture between three nations, and the first time I walk on the premises, a fight breaks out. <clears throat> Ow. Let us try out their weakness. It is time to strike. Our victory is assured. Hell yeah. I see the he learned the bird of prey. Fire. There's a very, there's a lot of bird imagery happening here. I don't know if you noticed. Hawk strike. Uh, you know, I don't know. Uh, Okay, they're coming. All right, that dude's gonna be tough. You can tell already. All right, he's gonna move. This guy's pretty fucking badass. He's gonna move right here and use sprint. I don't think you need to sprint. I think you can just stand right there. Ow. Shall we begin? Who's this? The healer? Okay, she needs to go here. I believe she's safe there. Cure wounds does not quite reach him, damn it. Um Okay, never mind, back it up. I'm gonna go ahead and just keep her here and use cure wounds on no, nobody needs it. Hold on. We gotta be smart. Put her back here. Cause he's gonna need help soon. Cause he's basically been tanking for us this whole time. Okay, now she should be able to reach there and blast both of those guys. That's big. Oh, you do have to pick a...
Okay, that makes a lot more sense. Okay, go ahead and do that. Come on. Close. Ow. Oh, he dodged it. Nice. Uh oh. Ow. I will end this. <laughs> that throw poison is... Oh, it's only two range. Okay, that's why. I thought she could do more than that. Damn, this is actually a little tough. We're actually not looking great right now. Um, yikes. Maybe we do kind of want to... How about this? Move here. Throw poison at the tougher guy. Can I... I can't? Oh, because he's in the way. Okay. So... <laughs> fuck. All right, fine, just, you know, what if I did this? Let's have her move down here and then use that ice. Nope, can't even hit that. Damn it, man, this, okay, just go here, use. Throw poison. Okay, I poisoned him. And now I'm going to... Attack him, I guess. <laughs> All right, whatever. Okay, he's gonna need to heal. However, he does have a really good position right now. So I'm gonna keep him there and just, and just use a healing item. Try this. this game is so much nicer than Final Fantasy Tactics. You mean like more forgiving? Here I come. <clears throat> You'll get no mercy from us. Nice. Blinded that asshole. I was also thinking that it's a lot nicer than Final than Fire Emblem. But this mission's kind of tough. I'm I'm actually a little nervous right now. Um It's a lot more forgiving, yeah. I never played Final Fantasy Tactics, but Fire Emblem, I'm I'm like a veteran of that series. I've played most of the most of the main entries. And um Okay. There's a puddle there now. <laughs> um Oh come on. I'll take you on. Alright, bruh. What can he do? He can use sprint. You know what? Let's use that. Push on through. And, and now he can move further. So let's get him into the battle because he's like not doing anything right now. So let's get him over here. Shall we begin? She's the healer. Okay, so she needs to go here and heal up. Yeah, heal up Corentin. I see a path to victory. Oh, 
Oh, wow. Jump. I never even thought about that. Some characters can jump higher than others, which means you can go up these different ledges. That's cool. I don't think I've ever seen that in any game before. That's really cool. Cause like the, like she probably can just go up any height cause she can fly, but everyone else like, yeah, there might be like a ninja character or something. They can climb up walls to some extent. That's cool. I never thought about that. Okay, but we're not gonna use that. We're gonna use Raging Beast on him. It is time to strike. Our victory is assured. Cause he's like boosted right now. I think he should just stay there. He's holding that line by himself. Uh oh. Oh god. These are no green soldiers, but tri he might actually be in trouble. No. Oh man, this is <laughs> this mission's tough. I can tell already. Oh. Miss? Nice yeah, thank you. You're blind. You should miss. Okay. Oh man, if only I could get over there. Okay, let's blast these two. No. Oh, she's okay. She's okay. Oh, fuck this guy. What a dick. Hang in there. Okay, she needs to do. Hmm. Already. I think he's going to need some help up here. I'll take this. <clears throat> Do now. Same thing. I think. He, I think he needs to just sort of keep tanking. He's doing a really good job just tanking right there. He went right to the one spot. No, Serenoa. Oh no. He fell. I guess we can do it without him. Oh man. This is rough, dude. Okay, go down here. Hold on. No, 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 no. Use it on yourself. Was that a rhino? If it's a fight you want. He has not been helping us. Oh, come on. Cool heads shall prevail. All right. Who needs heals? He does. Okay. She should probably fall back a little bit though. Um, and then heal him up. Allow me. Much better. 
My growth is playing. She leveled up. I'll take you on. Come and get me. He's dragging his feet. <laughs> Open up sexy says Taryn McCockner, everybody. He's here and he's ready. FBI, open up! <laughs> I fight for peace. Oh, Taryn. Or, um. Oh my god. What was the original? Phil, of course. How could I forget? Um, okay. What's going on here? We need to do some magic. Is she on an icy space? Yes, she is. Okay, so she needs to move over here. That's still icy. She needs to, she needs to go there. No, she doesn't have enough magic. Phil and Doug and Barry. Oh, Barry's good. I like Barry. <laughs> um, God fucking damn it. You know what? Stay right there. We'll do the whole no action thing. So she'll get to go again soon. I'll be fine. Carrington's low, but oh god, he's like okay, use an item, use an item. Um, but how are you doing, Taryn? We're playing some. T oh my God! Nice you missed. It's not over yet. We're playing some triangle strategy. I'm trying to do triangles. Why does that do the same amount? You don't stand a chance. Okay. Uh, sports betting is stressful. Oh, my uncle does that. He's a big sports better. He's actually an advisor to sports betting. He likes to. He like hire people hire him to like give them the picks, and then if things don't go well, it's bad for him. But he's a millionaire, so he you know he he did well. Okay, this is her time to shine. This'll hurt. For you. <laughs> the hunt is on. No mercy from us. Victory is Hell yeah! We blinded the archer. The winds of change are blowing. I follow this guy's picks and he won 11k off a 5k bet. Damn. Oh, 100, 111k. Jesus. Yeah, may, maybe I should start gambling. <laughs> Y'all ready for some gambling streams? It's a fight you want. Don't underestimate me. Um, thanks for helping finally, Jesus. I see a path to victory. Bruh. Bruh, what? <laughs> Don't bruh me. I do play some poker. I'm, not, I'm actually not bad. <laughs> the last second a guy got his fifth rebound. Oh shit. Are you talking about March Madness? Allow me. Mm. 
You were shitting bricks. Bam! We will make <gasps> She leveled up. Yeah. NBA. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. Oh, God. If he dies, we lose. We have to protect him. Oh, no, wait. That's her. Okay, we're okay. We're okay. We're okay. Um, oh, God. She's kind of low, too. Does she have, like, any attacks? Like, if she, if she came around here... And just to hit him, would it would it kill him? Oh, he'd have one health left. Seriously, Ugh. we're better off just sacrificing her and using the, her healing ability one last time. Your are Thank you. She should at least turn around, though. I don't, I don't experience anxiety, but fuck my booty pipe. <laughs> wow. I'm glad I'm just sort of engaging that guy with with that dude. Um, okay, I'll be right back. I just gotta use the restroom real quick. Um, let me throw a blue shell at myself. Damn it, didn't beat it back. <laughs> All right. Miss? That's what I thought. Okay. My turn. Suffer. All right, poison that guy, and then poison that guy. Oh, I love Anna. She's so fucking awesome. Uh oh. Are we doing okay? On the connection? Oh shit. Hopefully that'll clear up. I won't lose. Nice. Oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Let us pry out their weakness. 
Um, his turn. Okay, so I think he should probably Honestly I would mm. You know what he needs to oh fuck Yeah, finish that guy off you have nothing left. There we go If it's a fight you want What the fuck is he doing? Oh shit, that hurt. Okay, we're gonna have to rush over here. Oh god. For myself. The good news is that it's not like Fire Emblem. This is not the Choco Mountain I remember. Hello, Zooey. Welcome, man. Um, the good news is we don't have to make... Like, people can die and it's okay. It's not like Fire Emblem. They're good. Appreciate it. <laughs> Zooey, Zooey, yo mama. Why is the bit rate down so low, though? I don't understand. Oh, fuck it. All right, this is him. We're still trying to take down this guy. I think we need the extra forces down here, though. I'll be your shield. Time for some research. Can he reach up there? Oh, he can't. Yeah, we need to get this this little squad <laughs> over here. Can can you just move there? Please, thank you. <clears throat> yeah, it says the the bit rate's really bad. I don't know what's going on, man. I don't. I don't know how to fix that. It fucking pisses me off. All right, that guy's dead. Cool. I was prepared for this. Anna, who should be able to, honestly, she should just go down here, throw poison at him. Oh, it won't hit. Damn it. Okay. She's so low. She needs to heal. Just have her fall back for now and let her use a large healing item. I'll take this. And yes, she can use another one, but there's no point, so. I cannot die. Not until I make my dreams for the future a reality. No, it's not you, it's me. I don't know what's going on, but <laughs> it pisses me off. I'm hoping it'll, it'll just go away after a little while. What does Fell Swoop do? Oh, that's a close, a little closer range. Okay, so that's like her thing that she does when she's close range. I think we need to have her, well, oh, you know what? Use it now. Yeah, she can take out that guy. Oh no. The 
I mean, the only thing I can do is reset the router, but I'd have to start the stream over. Which I don't really want to do. I shall try my level best. Stay composed. That'll do. I will end this. When did Gustadolf muster up such a force? But I know I am in the right. They will... We've been weakened. I won't lose! My turn. You won't escape. <laughs> Come at me. Come and get me. The hunt is on. Alright, finish that guy off finally. Okay. And then now she can help with the main fight. Oh, ooh, there's an item there though. These foes are not to be trifled with. A brief respite. Yet. Yeah, boost his defense for sure. You won't get away with this. Why is he just hiding? I mean, I guess that's good because I'm supposed to be protecting him, as opposed to like missions where like the fucking person you're trying to protect like runs into danger. I guess that's good, but still. <laughs> Take cover. Become invisible for two turns. Effect lasts. Effect will be lost if you attack or stand directly in front of a, a foe. Wow. Sound strike. 
Shall we begin? Your wounds are healed. My utmost thanks. He needed that. <laughs> From this range. <laughs> She's such a good character. I love her. I see a path to victory. to strike that'll do Nice. Your orders. Allow me. This will be big. Have another. Cause then she can do it again. There it is, Wall of Ice. Told you he would get that ability. Shall we begin? <clears throat> Be at ease. That's the stuff. I've been waiting for this. Time to strike. Splendid. For the future of House Wolford. I won't lose. And that's yes. GG, everybody. <clears throat> All right, I'm going to try to fix 
the issue. So if we disconnect, I apologize. You're testing. Yeah, no, I'm testing as well. Um, let's see if that helps. Okay, that did seem to help, actually. Okay, we're back. Um, cool, that was actually a tough fight. It was fun though, really fun. I will say there is something a little less satisfying about the fact that I can sacrifice units. Um, I know that's sort of like chess, you know, but the fact that I can just put, like, I had Saranoa just holding the front line as long as he could, and then he fell, and there's really no repercussion to that except that you can't use him for the rest of the fight. But in this situation, it worked. But in Fire Emblem, you can't get away with that unless you're willing to lose the character permanently, you know? So I don't know, it's a little bit different. Um, but yeah, Alleyway, let me know, is, is it running smoother now? It says, it, everything's green on my end now. 